Here's how to manage bradycardia, according to the American Heart Association Advanced Cardiac Life Support Guide. Bradycardia is when your heart rate is very low, less than 50 beats per minute. In that case, you want to identify and treat the underlying cause of the bradycardia. That might include assisting breathing and giving oxygen, putting somebody on a cardiac monitor, doing a 12-lead EKG, and obtaining IV access. Then, if there's persistent bradycardia with symptoms like hypotension, acute altered mental status, signs of shock, ischemic chest discomfort, acute heart failure, then you want to intervene. If you don't have any of these problems, you can just monitor and observe the patient. If you do have any of these signs or problems, you then want to give atropine one milligram IV every three to five minutes, up to three milligrams of atropine max. So do three rounds of atropine every three to five minutes. If that doesn't work, you can transcutaneously pace the patient. Alternatively, you can give dopamine five to 20 mics per kilogram per minute, or you can give epinephrine two to 10 mics per minute. If that still doesn't work, you might want to consider expert consultants, so find cardiology, or do transvenous pacing.